Around 600 people came from all over to feast on a free Thanksgiving meal for the more than 30-year community dinner Bemidji tradition. Jamil Donath tells us how many families came together as a community to give thanks and eat some turkey. Whether coming from far, we're from Orange County, California, or coming for years. My husband and I used to deliver meals since, since the 80s. The Bemidji Community Dinner has been making it a tradition for more than 30 years to fill hundreds of people's bellies with a free Thanksgiving feast. It's just been really nice to see everybody in the community out here serving each other. Some of them come once in a while and some of them come all the time, but, but they all appreciate the whole thing. And with around 600 people to serve, nothing makes a community dinner run smoother than an efficient assembly line of volunteers. 25 servers, and then we had 15 kitchen staff. I just, I just and then people come in and, and just volunteer on their own. Volunteers were busy serving up heaping helpings of mashed potatoes, gravy, stuffing, and of course, tons of turkey. We're very pleasantly surprised to see what they have going on here. It's, uh, it's remarkable that the, the, the people have done a great service. We're very excited to be here. Some people traveled halfway across the country to come to the community dinner. This is definitely hospitality here. We heard about a spectacular dinner that was going on at the Lutheran Church and, uh, and we were very fortunate because our mother lives here in Bemidji. While others have been coming to this meal for many years, whether volunteering or attending. Now I bring the other widows here with me for the last nine years and then we come to the meals where whatever church they're at. So it's safe to say on Thanksgiving no one at this community dinner is going hungry for that Minnesota hospitality. Jamil Donath, Lakewood News. And community dinner volunteers also delivered more than 200 takeout turkey dinners in just 20 minutes. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.